Okay, so to begin with, I've just moisturized her face with this Patanjali moisturizer. Now for foundation, I'm using the Swiss Beauty High Coverage Foundation. It is 350 rupees and I was really surprised because the packaging is so luxurious. It comes in a glass bottle. Now throughout the video, I first hated the foundation, but then I realized that it was my mistake that the foundation didn't work properly in the beginning of the video. At first when I applied it, the shade was a little lighter than her skin tone, but then it oxidizes later. So here I'm just like roughly, you know, applying this all over her face just for me to have a clue of how the foundation is and how the texture is. Now to tell you what really went wrong with the foundation is that after applying a lot of moisturizer, I didn't let, you know, her skin like absorb everything and I immediately went in with the foundation so everything was just sliding off and after that I went in with a concealer and I did not set it so it was my fault because later on in the video you can see that the foundation actually looks very nice so here I'm just taking this concealer and concealing her under eyes and her skin now after her Mrs. India event uh, she's been having some hormonal issues and because of which she's getting acne also, I think Yaru Kannu Vechitanga. But yeah, I'm just like concealing all of that. Uh, after that, I will just move on to the eyes. Now, this is how I usually do her makeup for a lot of events, for uh, her shows and all of that. So, here I'm just going to conceal everything. Now, I was just being very light because I didn't want to irritate her skin. After that, I just take a small blender to just blend everything seamlessly. Now for eyeshadow, I'm using this mask, the Modern Matte Eyeshadow. And trust me, this is just 199 rupees. It has fun colors and the eyeshadows are amazing. So first I'm just going to use this orange one into her crease. Now you can see here that I have placed my thumb on her forehead. The minute I remove my thumb the foundation from that place just like comes off. So I hated it at that moment but then only later on I realized that it was my fault. Also I should have done her foundation after I finished with the eyes but yeah I just like kind of work with it. These eyeshadows were very 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 easy to work with, easily blendable and uh, they were not at all chalky, they were very smooth in texture, I absolutely loved these eyeshadows. Next I'm just using that brown shimmery shade on her eyelids and I'm just like using it all over her eyelids. Next I'm just going to take that very berry kind of a shimmer shade and I'm going to put it just on the outer corners to like you know darken her uh, outer crease. And then I'm going to go back with my blending brush and blend everything seamlessly. Now whenever I do her makeup, I hate using, you know, eyeliner or, you know, gel liner. I always use a black eyeshadow and I kind of smoke it very close to her lash line. It gives a very nice effect, you know, it's very soft yet smoky and I like that look on her. So I'm just doing that. I'm taking a black eyeshadow from the same palette and I'm using it very close to her lash line.
After that I'm just using a highlighter shade and highlighting her brow bone and her inner corner. Now to fill in her brows I just take a dark brown shade from the palette and I fill it only on the outer corners whenever I'm doing someone's eyebrows I just fill the outer corners and whatever's left on the brush I put it in the front that way it gives a very natural look here I first fix the foundation I, I put another layer of foundation and then I set it immediately and after this the foundation looked amazing it did not move it did not like slide off Here I'm just using the Swiss Beauty Kajal which is like 249 rupees, very cre creamy, very pigmented and I'm going to first put it all over her waterline and then I'm just going to use the same berry shade and smoke her bottom lash line. Here just to make her eyeshadows pop out more I'm using the Kiss Beauty Glitter Liner. I loved this uh, product because once it dried it felt really light on your eyelids and uh, it is just 149 rupees each and you can see what a difference it makes in the whole eyeshadow look. I will send these products from the site called Color Nation and honestly Looking at the prices, I did not really believe in the product much but trust me the products are amazing for such an affordable price. I loved working with these products. Here I'm just very lightly contouring her face and her jawline and then I'm going to go and apply any kind of blush. Now the next product that I absolutely loved is this Mion Drop Highlighter which is 2.99 rupees each but the thing about these is that you have to work really quick with it because it dries very soon. Uh, in real, in person it looked amazing on her skin and I loved how it, you know it has a very smooth finish so I absolutely loved it. It didn't have those glitters, it was just very uh, you know smooth and uh, glossy. Now moving on to my favorite part, this is the lips. These uh, liquid lipsticks are just 75 rupees if I'm not wrong. I first usually you know fill in the lips and then go in with a lip brush and you know um, clean the edges. I love applying lipstick on people because I'm very 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 obsessed like I am obsessed with you know perfectly applied lipstick so that is what I'm doing here now color nation was very kind to give me a discount code so my discount code is M A R R Y 10 and you will get 10% off now just imagine these products are already so affordable and 10% off on that is just amazing so here I'm just you know applying the lipstick and that is the finished look You can see the foundation had a very nice finish it, it it was matte yet it had a little bit of gloss and I loved the finish it's perfect for dry skin girls I also want to thank my friend for being such an amazing sport like her skin was not doing well but she still agreed to do this video for me so thank you so much and this is the finished look I hope you guys enjoyed it I will leave all the products the prices everything in the description box so please check it out and uh, like and subscribe until next time bye